What were your uh, lessons learned uh, from Saturday's match, and how are you guys applying that to Montreal this week? Yeah, I think the obviously, I think the main thing is is we we struggled a little bit being just consistent and sharp on the ball. Uh, there was a couple of mistakes for myself that. Um, just misplaced passes, and I thought that was a little bit of a consistent thing over the course of the game, and that kind of gave them chances to counter, and, and they did well in that. Um, they also, um, we we noticed that they sat in a little bit more and tried to play the counter, and, and that's what some teams are starting to do now, and they're picking up that we're going to have more more possession even away from home. So we have to be w more uh, aware when we have the ball, where their players are, like Piotti, uh, especially this this upcoming game because he's not he's going to peel away from some of our defenders and try and find spaces and pockets to pick up the ball and run at our back four so we just need to be aware of that and and uh, and be sharp on the ball so Montreal coming in hovering just below the playoff line in the east a couple new additions since you guys last saw them earlier this season what are you expecting from them here on Wednesday yeah they're a good team they made a couple of really good additions to the side and um, they have a they have a really good attack and we have to be aware of of Piatti, Aduro, and uh, Mancosu. So they have they have really good pieces, and we just need to, like I said before, we just need to be sharp on the ball and, and be more uh, more clean. It's just it's really we kind of hurt ourselves against Columbus, and and if we can just take those pieces, this guy. If we can just focus on being sharp on the ball and uh, be aware when we have it so we don't get countered as easy, uh, I think that'll play a big part in getting a win uh, against Montreal.